welcome everyone, we're back, we're back in business, how y'all doing? Yes, it's good to see you, I've been off on holiday the last two weeks, I missed all of you, especially our female viewers, all two of them, and apparently quite a few of our male viewers missed me too, got some email, but we're kind of creepy, but oh well, beggars can't be tutored, yes, went out to the Maritime and Northeast U.S., uh, what was it like out there? Well, I'm not going to talk about that, but the beer, got quite a few varieties of beer there relative to their side, and they uh, they actually did have quite a quite a few good beers out there, too, from what I've tried. So, we're going to do maritime beers for the next couple of little while, but first, we have a birthday to go through. we got Kevin Beaver Albrecht. He's a major sponsor of our show. Big pink bra for you. That's right. Okay, first beer we have for, uh, how are we going to do this? Do we do it in chronological order? Okay, we'll start with New Brunswick. Tonight's beer is, this beer is from Fredericton, New Brunswick. It's called Plaid to the Bone. Yeah, we know where that's going, right? Yeah. This is called a Heather Ale. Heather Ale is ale that's produced with Heather, which is a kind of a flowering plant. Heather Ale is probably the oldest style of ale still made in the world. It was been brewed for the last 4,000 years, starting in Scotland. Uh, this is, comes from... Uh, Northampton Brewing, which is almost really, really, it's a craft brewery in, in New Brunswick. They haven't made too much headway into Ontario, the rest of Canada yet. And their style of beer is called Picaroon. Picaroon is a type of logging tool they use out specific to New Brunswick. So, anyways, plaid to the bone. It's got a nice looking scowling red dragon on it. So, to open that, we are going to do big brass boobs. Yes, I know you all messed her. So, let's see how this ale is going to try out. I guess after they make the ale, they, uh, they, they pour it into a big vat full of heather and let it uh, fit, sit for a while. Hmm, it's definitely got a very different smell to it. Definitely a, a heather-like smell. Hmm, well that's not too bad, I guess. It's different. Nah. I'm not a big ale drinker. It's, it's, it's not bad. It's very bubbly, but it's just got that taste in there. I think it must be that heather that I'm just not used to. Is it all right? It's different, not for me though. I wouldn't try it very much. Uh, anyway, if you're in New Brunswick, you should really try, if not that particular beer, Plaid to the Bone, then try one of their other beers. They make, oh, they have over a dozen different styles of beers. So they're not a small brewery, but they're, they're crap or they're big in New Brunswick, and that's good. So that's all we have for tonight. I miss you all, and we're going to be doing, like I said, lots of East Coast brews the next month. And yeah, here you go. Try this uh, Plaid to the Bone. Jansen out. <laughs>